So for us, we think there's this opportunity to engage, have people engage through a second screen while they're watching TV. So for us, the first part is checking in, saying, hey, I'm there, I'm watching this specific show. And, but the next level is to get people to do more interesting things while you're actually watching. And so whether that's social, whether that's people you know, chatting with other people that are actually watching the same TV show, um, whether it's playing games, maybe it's taking quizzes, maybe it's you know, getting points for doing things, um, it's still too early to know what's actually going to work. Um, but as a business, we believe that there will be a second screen. There's a lot of other startups that, you know, even other companies that are thinking, hey, let's you know, Google TV launch, and they said, hey, we're going to put more things on the screen. And for us, we think, I don't think people want to get distracted on the TV screen. And, um, but the iPhone and the iPad is a perfect device for ambient information to sort of flow and for you to engage through a second screen. This is the future of the second screen. The se future of the second screen is I'm watching 24 and um, Jack Bauer appears on screen and immediately when he appears on screen information is pushed to me about Keith, Keith Sutherland. It's not, I'm not searching for more about him. I actually know about him so I know it but it was a, if it was another sort of character that I didn't know anything about I would, it would be pushed to me versus searching for it. Like that's how, why am I searching for stuff? It should, all this information exists. In the same way closed caption appears on, on um, on TV, why can't web information be pushed to me? So here's MISO. Um, it's very uh, sort of a foursquare for TV. Um, so while you're watching TV, you can check in, share what you watch. So um, here I am. Here's what here's what my friends are watching. Here's what I'm watching. It's sort of like a a feed of of my friends and their entertainment activities. Um, so someone's watching um, American Idol last night. I guess some people are getting some badges for watching 24. Um, we also have like a public feed as well, so here's actually a live feed of, of um, what everybody's watching on, on TV. So 11 seconds ago, someone's watching something called The Road, ESPN Sports Center. So um, obviously I'm not watching TV right now, but if I was, I would click on Check In, um, and we show you what's actually trending. Um, so it's not just shows that are on TV, but it's actually shows that appear all across the web, so you can see a lot of Revision 3 stuff um, emerging. I guess people are still watching Lost right now. Um, People are probably playing a little bit of catch up, so uh, so you can see he, people are checking constantly. You can see more about these people. So if I'm if I'm watching Lost, which I'm not, but let's say I am, um, I can uh, click, click check in. I can add a comment, and I'm going to say I'm uh, word. People are going to be like, "What are you, ta what are you talking about?" Um, you can add your location. So if you're watching a sports game at a bar, you can say, hey, I'm watching this game at a bar, and then you can determine what you want to share back to your networks, right? So share it back to Facebook, to Twitter, and Foursquare. And you confirm, and then um, you get hopefully a nice little message that says uh, you've you got some points for checking in. And uh, as a result, uh, you can collect some badges. Um, so. Uh, we've we've done um, you know for, it's not just uh, for TV shows it's actually movies as well so depending on the movies you can actually get action badges you can move up um, I, gu I guess I haven't watched a lot of movies recently um, and um, you, we've also done a partnership with Revision Three so for Revision Three sh uh, viewers you actually can get Revision Three specific badges and so here's uh, my profile so you can see who you're following who else is following you we have a very Twitter like model. So it's it's not very it's not very private driven. It's entertainment, right? It's, you know, people watch. It's un unlike location, people can kind of find out what I'm watching. So you can find friends through Twitter and Facebook. Um, and this is sort of an early version. We have a lot more coming. So um, there you go. We have an iPad and, a, and web version of GoMiso.com as well.